Okay, to, in order to install the software on the uh, uh, quadcopter, you will need uh, to use this FDDI to serial converter. So, well, it's uh, you need to plug on the right connectors. Hmm? You, you can be wrong because they are not the same size, they don't have the same size. So, uh, you need to install, uh, to go to the FDDI's uh, web pages and, uh, well, go to download uh, the last version 2.12 well be aware I'm not sure uh, this uh, FDDI serial commenter is a real one so I'm aware that since uh, uh, two release of uh, drivers uh, if it's a fake one you can have some problem when flashing but uh, it should be okay, so I'm working with them. Uh, this is this last version of, of our firmware, and I don't have any problems. So, so uh, go to download this driver, and after you will have to install Arduino. So it's not very hard. You just Google Arduino, and um, you you go to the um, uh, main pages. Okay, and uh, well, it's not very hard. And go to download section and uh, you just need to download and that's all so uh, the first things uh, uh, oh there is a new one I guess uh, me I installed the uh, uh, 105 and I think there is a new release uh, 106 okay so it should work also with this one um, what you have to do is to first install the serial conversion and then the Arduino and then uh, uh, go to the uh, uh, SuperX, I unzip this um, zip file there, okay, and uh, and after it's very easy, uh, you have to click on the Arduino, okay, uh, load the uh, uh, sketch of Arduino, so by default I install it here, and you have to select the um, multi we you know there okay and when you have done you have to plug on the um, quadcopter okay. so if your driver is are correctly installed um, the window should see this uh, a new virtual uh, com so and it's very easy to, uh, to flash you just need to uh, press this button it will compile the other sources and uh, transfer to the um, to the um, quad capture so we proceed you can read some log compilation logs on the button and is writing look is writing through the FDDI server converter and uh, while well, mine is installing COM17 it takes approximately one minute to download oh what I forgot to say that by default I select the board uh, Arduino Pro Pro Mini 5 volt 6 okay and the serial port is 15 Okay, so at the end you should have a message like this that is done. So you, you just need to uh, unplug and replug and it's uh, uh, flashed. But uh, the more uh, tricky part is starting is the PID configurations.